Hi, good afternoon. It's Debbie Sasson here, financial planner and money coach. And I'm speaking to you from a nice garden in the center of Jerusalem. I wanted to share with you one of my client's success, success stories that she shared with me yesterday. Uh, let's call my client Barbara. And Barbara and her husband have been working with me since the beginning of the year, since January. And they're working really diligently to rein in their spending and you know spend less than they earn on a monthly basis and Barbara shared with me that before the Passover holidays in April she gave each one of her teenage girls a budget and she to and being a mother of three girls who are now graduated to their 20s I've I really appreciate the fact that when you tell girls they're only allowed to spend a certain amount of money on clothes that can send you know shock waves of horror through their systems because they want to be able to, to buy so many things because they need shoes, clothes, jewelry, makeup, whatever it is. So Barbara decided to give her girls each a budget and indeed it was you know, met with like horror uh, originally when she, when she told them what it was and they were like, and, and she explained that you know this is the money that you get and when it's done, it's done. So you're, you're going to have to decide you know, with this budget that I'm giving you, with this amount of money that I'm giving you, do you want to spend it on clothes or shoes or makeup or a new handbag or something like that? And she said that her girls were actually really appreciative of the whole process. And although they started out thinking like, oh my gosh, this is never going to work and how are we going to manage? They gave them the power to choose. It gave them the power of choice because all of a sudden, they had to be discerning about their spending and they had to make decisions that were really in alignment with their needs and in their wants and not just haphazard and willy-nilly start pulling their things off the shelves and buy, buy, buy because they liked it or it looked good or it was trendy. But the, her girls also had to put some thought and some you know, discernment and decision making into the process. And she said it was a real win from a money point of view and a parenting point of view. And I was so excited for her, for Barbara, and for her family, and for her children, because these are the kind of strong money habits that we can teach ourselves and that we can teach our children so that we will be able to live a financially sustainable future and to achieve financial freedom in our lives. Thank you so much for tuning in, to me to, uh, tuning in with me today. This is Debbie Sasson, financial planner and money coach, speaking to you from Jerusalem, helping you to build a healthy and confident relationship with your wealth. Bye now.